Hey, what's good, people? It's Vitas Tech checking out another banger from Tonegate for the Pixel 9 Pro Fold. Now, this one is coming in at $60, but it's currently on sale for $55.99. So, you know, you can save you a couple coins if you pick it up on Amazon during this weird four day sale that they're having. But yes, yeah, if you saw the last video, you're basically getting the same thing in the box. You get a little thank you card and a way to keep in touch with them. You have your warranty activation card, your installation pack for the front of the screen protector. You have how to stall the adhesive strips and how to replace them because yes, you do get extra adhesive strips, which is last video i took away a couple points for having adhesive strips on the front of the cover yo i need to go back in the comments and say something because i take away no points for this that screen protector this front stays on with no issues at all so you know what no points deducted i i spoke too soon <laughs> my bad but yeah so once again it's a two-piece case this is the screen protector so let's go ahead and peel that off we'll peel that off and so yeah once again it is two pieces of adhesive last video like i said i took points off of that for that this time no points deducted now i think i can get so i think i said two there's actually three pieces but once again, three pieces are not bad at all for the type of protection you're getting with this case. I take away no points, no points from Gryffindor. <laughs> so basically, you're just going to get it, install it right there, boom, boom. And then you'll give it a little press just to make sure that it's installed. Then we will go ahead and put on the back piece. Now, like I said, this is just a slightly less protective version of the other case so the other one you had like a little camera protector this one the camera is fully exposed and the other case had a kickstand that was built into the hinge this one you aren't getting a kickstand on the protector instead the kickstand is coming in right here which is so cool and then this piece actually has the MagSafe built in as well so that is really cool this honestly if i have to pick between the two cases this is the one i'm going to go with all day it's slightly less bulkier and it doesn't weigh as much as the other case while you're still basically getting max protection and then a lot of people go out and buy the protective lens for the camera so you'll probably be good there as well the camera is recessed down in there you can see that there is a little bump going around the camera so you don't have to worry about your cameras too much quick tour you do have your mic cut out you have your speaker cut out on here you are getting a little bit of grip and this is full hinge protection mode right here on the bottom mic cutouts speaker cutouts type c now i have a lot of like weird type c cables and none of them has had any issues getting in there so that's not a concern at all never experienced any issues on the right side you do have your volume so the buttons once again they aren't super tactile you do get a little bit of click just not super tactile if that's something you're you're into and then right above it you can see you have your fingerprint sensor fingerprint sensor is not an issue to get to boom boom no issues at all but right next to it is how you get to your kickstand it's not difficult to get to at all i like how they um made it on this case so you don't need a fingernail you don't need anything you just boom and it works on the front display it works if you're using it on the main on the bigger display in tablet mode it works this way which i don't recommend you use it this way but it does work but this is definitely the way you want to use it now it doesn't go all the way back if that's a concern of yours it does go up in different angles it just does not lay flat in any way and so when you're using it with the kickstand the hinge isn't being raised or anything so your phone is still being protected which i really like that is like a really cool way to like 
work in a kickstand. It doesn't add too much more bulk to the phone at all. Plus, built into it, you can see there's the MagSafe ring. Now, on the other one, through trial and error, we did have to learn that you have to put it in a certain way for it to work on some wireless chargers. This time it's working fine without any issues because, you know, I figured out how to put it in the right location, but wireless charging is not an issue. And then we will go on to MagSafe. Now, if you do use a MagSafe charger, we'll throw it on right there. Make sure the MagSafe is turned on and you can see MagSafe charging, no issues at all. Now, the grip, it is not, you can see, you're not gonna be doing all this. Let's see how much force it takes to come off. So, that, <laughs> I just slammed the heck out of my phone. That is how much force it takes to get, you know, whatever charger you're using, you are not gonna be doing this. So this is not really strong MagSafe. You don't have to worry about the magnetic connection at all. Say you have a MagSafe wallet, throw it on the back, line it up just like that, boom. So the MagSafe is really strong on this one. You are not gonna be doing all this, so I have no concerns about MagSafe on here. Let's bring one more MagSafe in here just to be safe. You can see it's charging up with no issues at all. So the MagSafe built into this case is extremely strong. Like I said, between the two cases, this is definitely the one I'm gonna be going with. I really like this one. I like how they worked the kickstand into the case. The other one is cool. You have two different ways. You have the kickstand from the camera and then you have the kickstand on the hinge. This one, that's a really nice touch. You could, I've been gushing over it so you can probably tell how much I actually like it. The case has a nice soft touch to it. It feels good in the hand, no sharp corners. Now, if you want to uh, use the front display, of course, nothing's being blocked. You're not losing any type of screen real estate, so you don't have to worry about losing any, any area on the front of the display. So that's nothing you have to worry about. It feels good. It looks good. It's not being... You know, you got a little bit of company branding here on the hinge, nothing just being thrown in, thrown in your face or anything like that. So overall, I think this is the new king. I am going to be trying out a couple more cases. I think this is, I've reviewed both cases from Tongate. Both of those cases are when you just have to figure out how much protection you want or need. This one is the one I will be going with. If you have any other cases you want me to check out, let me know, throw it down in the comments below. But yo, Tongate has put out two winners back to back. Yo, they are killing it. Appreciate them for making these cases. I paid for these out of pocket, so <laughs> no shout out for that. But yo, Tongate, yo, keep doing your thing. It's Vito's Tech. I'll catch you on the next one. Later.